Hi friends, uh, here is another problem of arithmetic progression. Uh, in this question, uh, we have to check whether these are the uh, arithmetic progression or not, arithmetic sequence or not, right? Let me read the question. Which of the following are APs? If they are, f they they form an AP, find the common difference D and write three more terms, right? So we'll be not doing this part, second part. We'll be just checking whether these are the arithmetic progression. AP means arithmetic progression, right? Whether they are arithmetic progression or not. Uh, as we have already learned right the main first condition main condition or the first condition is the difference between the two terms every time anywhere difference between the two terms must be constant right the common difference d must be constant right that should be constant if the common difference is constant in part any series or any uh, sequence or progression that progression will be an arithmetic progression right so ap that's arithmetic progression so here let me find out first here 2p arithmetic progression uh, means the always arithmetic progression is second term minus the first term so second term is here 4 and first term is here 2 so 4 minus 2 that is 2 right and now let me find the common difference between these two points so uh, here again let me do the always the term and the preceding term right first we'll write the term and the preceding is subtracted always to find the common difference so 16 minus 8 that is 8 since we get the two common difference means the common difference here is not constant in this uh, sequence or in this progression that is why we can say this is not an arithmetic progression right it is not an arithmetic progression now let me do this one here the second term is 5 upon 2 and first term is 2 so let me first find out the common difference right and is always the second term minus first term so again the if there is nothing there is 1 right so 2 and then 2 it's 5 and this one twoza and two twoza so it will be four so one upon two right so between these two we got the common difference half let me check whether we are getting here the uh, half or not right again the same common difference or not so d again right uh, so seven by two minus this three right so again seven this two threes are six divided by two that is half right so we again get the same common difference right since the common difference is same here here also we get the same here we also get the same and if we do here then again we'll be getting the same that is why since the common difference is constant throughout the terms right here is also same common difference here is also same common difference here should be also same common difference that is why we can say this is an arithmetic progression right so this point is an arithmetic progression this this series right or uh, this sequence now let let me do for the third one here the first one is minus 1.2 and second point is minus 3.2 so let me first find out here second term 3.2 minus first term so minus 1.2 right so minus minus it will be plus so minus 3.2 plus 1.2 again uh, minus 3.2 plus 1.2 it will be point 2.0 point right so it will be negative 2.0 2 minus 2 that is 0 and 3 minus 1 that is 2 right so minus 2 and let me do it he here again right let me do this 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 2 right so it will be minus 5.2 and since it is negative minus first term so it is positive 3.2 right so let me do here again 2 minus 2 that is 0 5 minus 3 that is 2 again right and negative means 2 again minus 2 here and again here minus 2 means twice we get the same common difference since the common difference here and the here are the same right we can see this is an arithmetic progression this is an arithmetic arithmetic progression right uh, actually i'm indian you know I'm, I'm i'm speaking hindi that's why you know uh, indian people speak a little bit differently arithmetic and you may you you might be from us or uk you your your accent may be something different so you might not be understanding my words so i'm sorry for that okay uh, but uh, I will do my best to speak and to uh, speak in uh, in such a language that you might understand my language. Okay, uh, okay, bye. Next, uh, sorry. Okay, next question. Uh, it's uh, one. Uh, sorry, uh, it's fourth one, right? So let me do the fourth one. That is minus ten, minus six. Okay. So now let me find the common difference here, right? So the common difference between these two is right. Again, the uh, uh, the first one and the preceding will, will be subtracted again minus 6 minus minus 10 right so it will be minus 6 plus 10 so it will be 4 right the common difference between these two is 4 now let me do this one right between these two between these two will be right here the first one is minus 2 right 
so minus 2 minus again minus 6 minus 6 right so it is again minus 2 minus minus plus 6 so again we got 4 and here also we got the 4 means the common difference here is also 4 and the here is also 4 since the common difference is same we can say this is also also an arithmetic progression right so let me do here again <coughs> So like this we used to check, right? So see this is 3 plus root 2 and this is 3 only. So let me find out the difference between here, these two, right? So 3 plus root 2, my first term minus second term, that is 3. So 3 and 3 will cancel. So I will just get root 2 here. The common difference between these two terms is root 2. And let me do it here for these two, okay, fine. So 3 plus 3 root 2, right? So 3 plus 3 root 2 minus, again 3 minus 2 root 2, right? 2 root 2 so plus 3 minus 3 will be cancelled and 3 root 2 minus 2 root 2 is only root 2 right here is also root 2 we get and here also we get root 2 since uh, the common difference is same we can again say this is also an arithmetic progression right so let's check for this this is here 0 0.2 and this is 0 0.22 and here is 0 0.222 and here is 0 0.0.2222 four times right so let me first find the difference between these two d right 0 0.22 minus 0 0.2 so i'm getting here 0 0.02 right so the first common difference is 0 0.02 let me now do for this it is uh let me do it here uh, right here 0 0.222 minus 0 0.22 right so what i'm getting here it's minus right so 0 point if you subtract 0 0.222 minus 0 0.22 two times right it's 222 uh, you can say 2 to 3 times and is 2 right so it will take this 2 so I'm getting 0 0.02 again see it's 0 0.02 0 0.02 and this is only 0 0.02 so the common difference is not same so I can't say this is a, I, I have to say this is an uh, this is not an arithmetic progression right so let's let me do this for for this okay so the here again the common difference let me find between these two right so a2 means second term minus first term right so it is again minus 4 and let me do for this uh, here the common difference is minus 8 minus minus 4 right third term minus second term so minus 8 minus minus plus 4 so minus 8 plus 4 that is minus 4 here also we get the minus 4 here also we get the minus 4 right so that is why this is an arithmetic progression right uh, i will suggest you uh, if you uh, you are watching through the youtube uh, you know so that's why at bottom right you know uh, of the bottom of the youtube at at here in the right corner and the light right bottom okay right button here is a button uh, in this shape right in the in this way in this way click on that it will make you the full screen okay it will make you the full screen and then only you can easily write it okay it's uh, so small letter so you might be feeling difficulty so here is a button to make it full so try to do this and watch in full resolution in, sorry what in full screen okay now another one let, let, let me do this okay uh, so here is minus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 minus 1 by 2 but simply so the common difference between these two minus 2 and minus 2 means bit, uh, this is the same one this is also same right so this minus this will be 0 always means the second minus first will be 0 again and the third minus this will be again 0 then the fourth minus third will be again 0 so the common difference are same so that's why this is an arithmetic progression though d is 0 we can see this is a common difference and we have already learned in previous video that Co uh, this common difference may be 0 greater than 0 or less than 0 right so here again this is 3 and 1 so the common difference is 3 minus 1 that is 2 and here 9 minus 3 right 9 minus 3 that is 6 so common difference is not same that is why this is not an AP now here right so common di uh, difference between these two is 2a minus a right so 2a minus a so this is a and again let me do for this 3a minus 2a right 3a minus 2a again a and if i do 4a minus 3 again i will get the a so the common difference is same i can say this is an arithmetic progression now see here i'm taking the common difference between these two okay here a square minus a i can't do anything this is the common difference right this is itself a common difference now for this common difference is again a3 minus a square i can take only the common a square and it will be again a minus 1 i can also take the common here a it will be a minus 1 so a 
times a minus 1 and a square times a minus 1 so these two are not equal it means this is not a or an arithmetic progression right this is also not an arithmetic progression now here it's 8 root 2 and uh, it's root 2 root 8 root 18 root 32 right uh, I think it's going to be very longer right I have to quit it quickly now it's rooted let me find the common difference here root 8 minus root 2 it is 2 root 2 minus root 2 right so I can't do anything this is the common difference only and here also again I'm, I'm, I'm uh, finding out the common difference of these two okay root 32 minus root 18 right uh, root 32 means 2 to the power 5 right so 4 root 2 and this is 9 to the 18 so 3 root 2 so it is again root 2 right so 3 comes because 3 square is 9 it's root 2 only here and here uh, 2 root 2 minus root 2 it's uh, 2 root 2 minus root 2 uh, means minus 2 root 2 minus root 2 it give you again root 2 right so root 2 and this root 2 both are equal right since the common difference is same I can easily say this is an arithmetic progression right now come here since it is 1 square that is 1 3 square that is 9 5 square that is 25 7 square that is 49 right so 9 minus 1 common difference first time finding out between these two 9 minus 1 right that is 8 and uh, between 49 and 25 okay common difference another common difference that is 49 minus 25 it is 24 right so since the common difference are not same this is not an arithmetic progression here also 1 square that is uh, no first let me do this one it's uh, between these two I'm uh, doing root 6 minus root 3 right root 6 I can't do anything because it is 2 times root 3 uh, root 2 times root 3 I can do and minus root 3 right so I can take root 3 common it will be again root 2 minus 1 right it will be root 2 minus 1 and let me do here again root 9 minus root 6 so what I can do this is 3 minus root 6 right so you know uh, it will be 3 minus root 3 minus sorry root 3 times root 2 so I'm taking this is also root 3 3 is equals to root 3 times root 3 so again root 3 is taking common so what I'm getting again root 3 minus root 2 right and the previously what we got here uh, yeah root 9 minus 6 and previously we got root 3 common root 2 minus 1 right so since the common difference is not equal that's why we can say this is an arithmetic progression right so this is not an arithmetic progression now let's come here 1 square that is 1 5 square that is 25 7 square that is 49 this is 73 now see 25 minus 1 that is 24 right uh, and again here 49 minus 25 this is again 24 right and 73 minus 49 right so this is again 24 right this is 24 this co difference is common 20, 24 and here was also 24 that's why this is an arithmetic progression I made it's so much messy right so like this we have to solve this kinds of problem whether uh, and we have to check right we have to just check uh, whether they are the uh, the common difference between the two terms everywhere right is same or not if the common difference is constant then the progression or the sequence is uh, arithmetic progression if there is no common difference same then simply will be saying this is not an arithmetic progression okay I hope you have uh, learned this properly and enjoyed the video okay we'll be meeting in the next video with the next kind of problem okay bye bye